Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Zeke, the Crypto Miner, and today I'm going to be bringing you the top five high dividend stocks for 2019. So let's get to it. All right, so we're back. So like I said, we're going to go over the top five high dividend stocks for 2019. Now, some of the requirements that I chose, I looked over 30 different high dividend stocks. And some of the requirements that I chose is that the stock has to have over a 6% dividend yield. The market cap have to be over $1 billion. And also, the positive uh, total returns of the last couple of years has to be cash, cash flow positive. But before I get into that, let me actually tell you about some risk factors that you guys have to look at and why I did not choose the other 30 high dividend stocks and, what I, and why I did choose these top five high dividend stocks I'm going to share with you. All right, so some of the risk factors that you guys want to look into when you're looking at high dividend stocks is actually the payout ratio, okay? If the dividends are paying out too much, that means the company does not have enough money to reinvest back into the company will actually end up getting outperformed by its own competitors. Now, if the dividend is actually paying too little, then it's not a high dividend stock, all right? All right, so some high dividend paying companies are usually utility companies and REITs, real estate investment trust companies, and um, those type of companies usually pay out more than blue chip style companies like in technology companies like AMD and NVIDIA. Now what's important to think about in REITs is that they usually pay out all of their profits back to these uh, investors and, and in fact they actually get a tax cut on when they pay out all of their profits back to their investors. So that's why real estate investment companies their payout ratio for dividends are usually higher than all the other stocks another risk factor to look at is the stock price of the company you actually want to look at the long trend of the company did the company tank in the last couple of years and rise its dividends just because the company tanked making the payout ratio really not that good so you guys actually have to pay attention to the long-term trend of that stock company has it been growing over the last couple of years I did a tank a couple years back and just increases dividend payout. So don't just jump on any high dividend stock, okay? All right, so like I said, we're gonna get right into the top five companies. Once again, the requirements for this company is to have over a 6% dividend yield. The market cap of that company have to be over $1 billion and the total cash flow has to be positive over the last couple of years for that one company. All right, so the first company that we're going to look at is the first company is CEQP, Crestwood Equity. All right, this company has a market cap of $2.62 billion with a dividend yield of 8.6%. Uh, Crestwood Equity is a company uh, dealing with oil and gas. They have pipelines and they rent out their pipelines to different companies to ship that oil and gas all across the country. Over the last year, the profits is up over 14.81%, $4 on a year. Right now, you could get Crestwood Equity for $36.51. All right, the second one is Cremera Investment. It is actually a re, a real estate uh, type of company. These guys uh, is the oldest and most dependable REIT out there, okay? This is one of the guys that's been around for a very long time that actually went through the 2008 uh, real estate crisis and they survived this so management at that company actually know how to survive through a a real estate crisis right now their market cap is at 3.5 billion uh the dividend yields is over 10 percent is at 11.22 percent yield for the year and actually uh cim Cremera investments is up 1.7 percent over the last year over the last five years it's actually up 23.47 percent so Camara Investments, you can get right now for $18.81. This company has been around through the recession, through the uh, houses crisis. So it know it's going to be around forever and it's one of the most dependable high dividend REITs out there. Once again, that's CIM, Camara Investment. So the third one is Alliance Bursting. Uh, right now on the year, they're actually up 5.21%. Their market cap is $2.83 billion, and this is actually another double-digit dividend stock, okay? Theirs is over 10.54% on the year, and if we scroll up and look at the five-year mark, uh, AB is actually up 18.64%. 
So um, AB is going is another great double digit dividend stock to invest in that actually beat expectations every single year and is able to pay out its ratios to an investors for a great dividend yield. All right. The next one is New York Mortgage Trust. It's a mortgage type of company. Uh, they buy in they buy depths of different mortgages and they sell them. Uh, over the last year. NYMT is up 1.65%. The market cap is 1.15 billion. And this is one of the highest dividend yields that I'm going to be showing you guys today at 13.58%. Uh, that's New York Management Trust. And this company buys and sells different mortgages, buys the depths and flip them. So uh, this is the highest dividend yield I'm going to be showing you guys today, 13.58% New York Mortgage Trust. And before I show you guys the last stock today, I want you to go down and hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you can be tuned to uh, whenever I upload a new video to YouTube. And leave a comment down in sections if you and leave a comment down in the comment section if you guys plan on buying any of these stocks or already have them in your portfolio and tell me how have they been been performing. All right. And the last one I'm gonna bring you guys is Sonico. It's actually up on the year 29.4%. It has a market cap of $2.64 billion and a dividend yield of 12.14%. So another double digit dividend stock. Sonico actually uh, owns fuel stations and they lease and rent out their fuel stations to different oil companies and sell them that way. So Sonico is another energy type a high dividend yield stock that has a market cap over $2.64 billion and a dividend yield of 12.14%. Hey YouTube, I just bought you five high dividend stocks for 2019, the top five that I'd seen out of the 30 that I had did research on. So go ahead and hit thumbs up for that. Um, did a little bit of different approach for this video, went outside for that. It was hot. I'm in Texas. It's actually humid. So go ahead. I, I deserve to subscribe for that. So go on down and scroll down just a little bit and hit that subscribe button. Also, the app I was using was Robinhood. It's a free commission app. All you have to do is sign up with the link down in the description. If you sign up, you get a free stock and I get a free stock. And just go down to the comment sections and let me know what free stocks that you receive. Uh, I hear people receiving stocks all the way uh, $200 stocks like Apple and one time I received a Groupon stocks which was like $2 so go ahead and sign up for the uh, Robin Hood app down below the link is in the description but yeah other than that it's your boy Zeke the Crypto Miner and I'm out